Daysmart Salon offers a companion app to our existing salon software. This is the Salon Iris Kiosk app. The Kiosk app is designed to run on iPads, with the idea that you would set the iPad at your front counter and customers can book an appointment or check in for an appointment that they've already booked. In this video, we'll go over the settings for the Kiosk app and how to use it. You can see on my iPad here that I have the existing Daysmart Salon app installed, and next to it I have the Kiosk app installed. Let's click on the Kiosk app to open it. We'll first need to sign into the kiosk app using our existing account information. This takes us to the screen that the customers would see if they walked in to use the kiosk. We could go through this now, but let's first go through the settings. We can find the settings by clicking the gear icon in the upper right hand corner of the screen. Go ahead and sign in with your password. Now that we're signed in, we have access to the setup menu. There are different options in here that we can go through, but let's start with look and feel. Look and feel lets us change how the kiosk app itself looks. We can choose between light or dark mode, we can choose a background image that we'd like to use, and you can also pick a theme color. Once you've made your selections here, click back. Now let's go into the employee settings. The first option here allows customers to choose the employee that they would like to book with. I'm going to leave this option turned on, and one cool thing that we can do here is set employee photos. By clicking on this, you can see that I have most employee photos set, but to add a new photo, click on the employee's name. We can either take a photo or select a photo. I'll go ahead and select a photo that I already have added to the iPad. And you can make some adjustments here as well. When you're finished, click the check mark in the upper left hand corner. Okay, so let's go back. And last item here is the app settings. And from the screen, we can select if we'd like the appointments booked through the kiosk to go straight to the appointment book or to the waitlist. Select the option that works best for your business. If you have the appointments going to the waitlist, you'll have to manually move them over to the appointment book when you're ready. We can also decide if we wish to have the customers enter their email address while booking an appointment or not. We have an option here for service categories, which I recommend leaving turned on. This will help categorize all of your services by category type. I'll leave this option selected, and we can click on to edit category photos. This gives us an option to select a photo to use per category. I have photos set up already, but if I click on one, you can see some of the options here. We have a number of stock photos preloaded into the app that you can choose from, or you can use your own photo. If we go back to the last two items in the list here, these are to show service descriptions and show service prices. And if you turn these on, customers would be able to see both while booking through the kiosk. But for right now, I'm going to turn both of these off. And we're done with the settings for the kiosk, so let's go back to the main screen and we can take a look at how the customer would see the kiosk when they come in to use it. We see the welcome screen and the customer would click check in. If they already had their appointment booked and they enter their phone number, they'll be checked in. And what they see at this screen depends on how you configured the settings. So it may ask for their email or not. If they don't have an appointment, they can finish adding the rest of their details to continue. At this point, they can select the service that they're looking for. And depending on if you enable the option to allow them to select an employee they want to book with, they could do that now. And that's pretty much it. It's very simple to use a kiosk. The customer comes in, selects their service, and then they can take a seat. Just keep in mind that depending on how you have this configured, the customer's appointment will either be on your appointment book or in the waitlist. For more information about the Daysmart Salon kiosk, check the description below.